Hi everyone, welcome back to another video. One of our senior colleague uh, who has been working as a architect position in one of the uh, product based company, he has given some advice to the junior programmers and who want to start their IT career as a programmer or a web developer. So he has given some valuable IT advice for freshers as well as experienced professionals. So I discussed with him around uh, two hours. So in that discussion, I picked some important points which might be helpful for all freshers as well as experienced professionals. So the first point is nowadays many candidates are doing one big mistake that is nothing but learning many languages at the same time. Okay, because they want IT job, they want software job within short period of time. It might be within three months or within six months. So they want software job with short period of time. So therefore, many of the candidates are they are learning the uh, IT courses parallelly. So they want to complete their IT course within three months or two months only. So if you learn many languages at the same time, then you may not be become perfect in at least one programming language also. Suppose if you are a beginner and you don't have any programming knowledge, then don't try to learn many languages, many courses at the same time. First to try to master in one programming language, then after having confident on particular programming language, then try to learn the relevant skills. Then try to learn the relevant frameworks or whatever the tools you have to learn, you can learn. So if you learn many courses parallel, then you will not become a master in programming language. So you have to stick only one language at a time. Once you feel comfortable on particular programming language, that means you must be strong in fundamentals or basic concept of that programming language. So after that, you can start to learn new one or new IT course. The second point is he has given the best and most valuable IT advice that is nothing but many candidates are doing, they are blindly copy and paste the code from the internet. So they doesn't know how the code works after copy paste the code in our project without knowing or without understanding the workflow or functionality of, the, of that code and they are using that code by simply copy and paste the code in your project or in our task so if you do like this you never understand the code functionality or workflow but he has given advice for this you can copy the code but you can copy the code, but before copy and paste the code, you must understand the how the code has written. So be, before copy and paste the code, you just make sure that how the code is working. You just watch that code till understanding. Then type yourself without looking the code. So if you do like this, then you can improve your coding skills as well or you can improve your logical building as well so this is one of the best it advice i heard so and the third one is this is also one of the most valuable it advice who are starting to learn any it course that is nothing but many of the candidates they are just watching the tutorials but not doing practice they are understanding the concept by watching tutorials and they are completing the course as well without practice. If you learn any IT course in this way, then you may forget whatever you learn within a week or within a two weeks if you are not doing any practice. So whenever you are watching any tutorial, you have to practice on the same day itself. You just do some experiments, whatever you learn the code, whatever you learn the topic. You just do some experiments and do some practice. And the next point is uh, this is also one of the most valuable IT advice I heard that is nothing but don't compare to any other programmer. Okay, so if you compare to any other programmer, you may feel I am not good at coding. So if you do compare with any other programmer, you may feel in this way only. So don't compare yourself with other programmers. You just compare yourself. Yesterday is a one percent is better. Today, or two percent is better. You have to compare yourself. You have to improve day to day. That means you have to learn a new concept every day. It might be five minutes concept or half an hour minutes concept or one hour concept. You have to learn a new concept every day and you have to practice it. 
so these are the valuable it advice that is given by one of our senior colleague i feel that these valuable advice might be helpful someone so therefore i am uploading this video definitely helpful someone who are starting their it career and it might be fresher or experienced professionals as well. so you should avoid these type of mistakes to become a successful programmer i hope this video is very helpful so if you feel this video is really helpful then don't forget to hit the like button and also don't forget to share to your friends as well so we'll meet you with one more useful content video thank you very much